In this video, I am going to show you how to calculate the area and volume of the cylinder. Let us first talk about curved surface area. The curved surface area of a cylinder is made up of the surface you can see in the green area. So, and it consists of two circles on the bottom and on the top. The circle is also known as the base of the cylinder. Uh, if you cut this cylinder from the from any position and then stretch it, you will see a rectangle uh, that is the curved surface, and the length of this rectangle is going to be two pi r, whereas the height is always s. Uh, in this case, we will have the area of a rectangle uh, l into b, which will give us two pi r s. This is how the curved surface area is expressed in terms of uh, 2 pi r s now for the total surface area if we include the curved surface area indicated by this region plus this is pi r square and there is another pi r square so the total surface area will be 2 pi r h plus pi r square plus pi r square so we will have 2 pi r r plus s this is how we calculate the total area of the cylinder so how to get the volume volume for the cylinder is always area of the base times its height area of the base is a circle and it's pi r square and the height is h in this case so the volume is pi r square s in this way we can find curved surface area total surface area and volume of the cylinder now let us see an example where we are given a cylinder of radius 7 centimeter and height 20 centimeter first curved surface area the curved surface area is given by 2 pi r h so in the equation 2 pi we can replace it with 22 over 7 and r is 7 centimeter whereas our height is 20 centimeter if you calculate it you will get 880 centimeter square this is our curved surface area Similarly, in order to find the total surface area, we have to we have to include this circle over here, this circle over here, which will be pi r square plus pi r square, that's two pi r square, and the curved surface area, which is two pi r h. So our formula becomes two pi r r plus h. If we're gonna replace uh, r and h, we'll get to 22 over 7 for pi r is 7 r is 7 plus h is 20 if we're gonna calculate it we will get it 1188 centimeter square this is how we will get the total surface area now let us see for the volume volume is given by pi r square h pi is again 22 over 7 times we have r r is 7 centimeter but square whereas h is 20 centimeter if you calculate it you will get 3080 centimeter cube in this way we can easily find the curved surface area total surface area and volume of a given cylinder 